Hello and welcome to my UT99 channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to change the background image in Unreal Tournament. First, we need to download the background changer at Old Unreal. When you are on the web page, search for background in your browser. In that way, you will find it very fast. You can choose to install the background changer and use it as the mod for changing your background image in game. You do that by copying the first six files from the system folder into your own Unreal Tournament system folder. The rest of the files are background images. Each image consists of two files, a U file and an in file. Choose a few of these uh, image packages to test if the mod works as it should. You will then find the option to change your background in the mod menu in Unreal Tournament. You can also choose to use Old School as your mod for changing background images in Unreal Tournament. It's a popular mod which can be used for much more. It is especially used for its additional single player option, but you can't have both installed since the background changer and the old school mod will mess each other up. You must use one of them, and I highly recommend the old school mod as we can make our own backgrounds using the files from the background changer mod without installing it. Therefore, the next step is to download the latest version of old school on GitHub. For this project, you can make do with these five files. Copy them into your Unreal Tournament system folder. If you have Photoshop, then it is time to install the Slice for UT action. Copy it into your Photoshop preset action folder. Depending on your version of Photoshop, the path may look different, but mine looked like this. Make a copy of the My Background folder. Rename it to what you want your project to be named. But keep the OSX part. I'm gonna rename mine into OSX YouTube UT99. Open the template with Photoshop or make a canvas of this size in your preferred image editing software. The finished image may have no more than 250 colors. But we will do a little workaround, which will give a slightly better result. Once done with your illustration, run the Slice for UT action, or manually slice the image into 12 equal pieces of 256 times 256 pixels. If the Slice for UT action does not show, tick on Actions in the Windows menu. Right-click the Action menu and press Play to activate it. The image must be saved in PCX format. Overwrite the pictures in the texture folder. Now open your slices and change the colors to 256. You do that by going to Mode and then choose Index. Save the image and repeat for each slice. In the Classes folder, rename the OSX My Background UC file into the name of your project and open it with a text editor. Change My Background to the same name you gave your folder. Replace all instances of My Background to the name you want. Then save the document. Now move the folder to your Unreal Tournament folder. Open up your Unreal Tournament ini file and find the Editor Editor Engine section. Add the following lines at the end. The last line should contain the name of your project. And mine is OSX YouTube UT99. Save and close your Unreal Tournament ini file and write CMD in the Windows search bar to launch the Windows command prompt. 
Copy the path to your Unreal Tournament system folder. Then write cd to change the directory and then paste the path through your Unreal Tournament folder. Now type ucc make. Then it will begin compiling the package you just added to the edit package line. If you get an error, open up the ucc log file in the Unreal Tournament system folder and see if you can track down the error. Your newly created u file is now in the u C system folder. Make a copy of the my background int file and rename it into your project. Open it and replace my background with the name of your project. In the description, replace my background with what you would like your project to be named in the Unreal Tournament menu. Save and move it to your Unreal Tournament system folder. And that is how you change the background image in Unreal Tournament. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to leave a like and subscribe for more gaming tips and tutorials. Have fun!